I turned it over too much out of the hand. Oh my god, what a start. I can't I cannot let Eagle win again. What is up everyone? We are back with another video from home because home is where it's the nicest. And we have a star guest today coming to defend this title because of course I needed a revenge playing Disc Golf Valley and welcome everyone, Eagle McMahon. Guess who's back guys? It's me, the champion. Or at least the champion against me and Simon from the last time we did the Disc Golf Valley. So, let's jump into it and have fun. <laughs> All right, sweet. I think we're both ready to start Disc Golf Valley. Nine holes, Eagle McMahon, revenge time. Let's do it. All right, starting the round against Eagle McMahon and of course, off to a hot start. This is the hole that is aced most in this game. And I think I've aced this probably a handful of times with my fuse. Um, Eagle still doesn't have a, have a distance driver. I have a couple recoils. I think I'm so close to getting a ballista, but I'm just disking down for this match rematch. Of course, Eagle beat me last time, but let me see if I can start it off hot. That is not hot. Perfect height, just way past it. Eagle is happy in the WhatsApp group. All right, I've gotten way better at this game. I believe if I get the worst spit outs of all time. Oh my God, what a start. I, can't, I cannot let Eagle win again. Especially, <laughs> especially after I've been practicing so much and he's never practiced. This is my jam. You know, I, I've been playing this game not that much. So I don't want anything too challenging. I want to keep it super easy. I'm going to throw a fuse. I got a little bit of a right to left wind. I'm going to go forehand, keep it low, playing conservative, sexton golf, and sit. Ah, so much slide. I, I'm, I'm all tensed up all of a sudden. Ah. I wonder what it's gonna be like when I get back on the disc golf course. All right, no, I don't wanna forehand it. Got my dad in the background, gotta be quiet. All right, right in the middle of my putt. I'm shaking. Oh my gosh. Two, two, oh my God. Nervous, oh my gosh. Simon, down by one, one stroke lead. Right off the bat, hole two is the hole over one of the many disc golf valleys. 243 feet, going with the accurate fuse. I've never had an ace in this game, guys. So maybe this is the day. I got a left to right win. Okay, let's just send it first class. Got a little bit of a backstop. Nope, that's not an ace. Pulled it, and now it's, oh, it's stuck pretty good. It's stuck pretty good. This is a, I like my chances on this spot. Line it up, center, little Anheuser, right in the middle. Okay, this hole is a bit tricky because it's so tempting to ace run, but if you go long, sometimes there will be, but of course I'm ace running this. I'm aiming low and left with this wind. Pull it straight back, shoot at it, turn, 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 turn. And now it has to sit, yes. Okay, I got lucky there on the skip. Sat right there and this putt better stick this time. Okay, no problem. One under through two holes. Very easy holes, of course. Dang it, Eagle birdied hole one. And uh, I feel like this might be the same as against Germ where I just have to wait until Eagle makes a mistake, but off to hole three. Wow, we are playing the easiest layout I've ever seen so far. This is the second easiest hole of the game and another hole in one chance with my trusty 
let's go for the fuse and go backhand because sidearm confuses me every time I try to throw it and I really want to throw this in all right right there give it some hyzer turn left turn left why doesn't it turn left like I was low anyway terrible attempt bro but should be a pretty easy par birdie play like a par two all right, two under. Come on, Eagle. <laughs> Dang it, of course. He just keeps birding all these holes. 246 feet. I remember this hole if you throw it back to last time. This is the time I took a, a big spike hyzer. I'm not going to do that because I'm more competitive now. 246 feet. I'm going to throw a sticky dagger just pretty much right at it. Maybe give it a little bit of an ace run. That works. Not an ace run, but on the green, on the dance floor, as some commentators say, I always love it when they use that term. The green is the dance floor. All right, line it up. Little left side, Annie putt, MJ style. Look down, you know the putt's in. All right, turkey to start off. Now we have this hole with two dead trees in front of the basket. 234 feet, hole four. I'm gonna throw a putter off the tee again. Left to right wind. Throw it down. Yeah, oh gosh. I'm just gonna rip it. I'm gonna rip it. Okay, that's over or oh my gosh, oh my no. No, come on. Into the water. Okay, still can save save the the par. Line it up. In for par. Oh gosh. I turned it over too much out of the hand. I have aced this before during a round. So let's see if I can figure this out. I usually aim like right on top of this little stump. And then if you shoot it right at it, turn left, turn left, turn left. Man, I keep missing barely. It's like I don't learn from my own mistakes. 65 footer. I just commit right in the heart of the chains, boy. Let's go. Kidding. All right, one under. Eagle, still no mistakes. Ugh. At least we're tied. Maybe that hole is technically mess upable. I will say that. Tie ball game right here. Tie video frisbee game. That's a term that you don't hear too much. On to hole five. I remember watching the video with Germ, last one of these that Simon did. And he had a certain way of playing this, but I completely forget. But have a right to left wind. I'm gonna go musket. I'm gonna throw as low as I feel comfortable with a forehand. Basically, you just want to get in the bowl, just straight up. It doesn't look that pretty, but that works just fine, I'd say. Don't want to putt with a forehand. Line her up. Center chains. Boom. Fuse, aim up here, backhand, turn it over slightly. Come on, flex out. Oh, that was so lame. Easy birdie. Hey guys, just a quick thank you everyone. These videos, especially these Disc Golf Valley videos, have been doing sit so well amazing amazing stuff and that's another birdie for me and eagle got a par yes 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 eagle got a par so it is tie game again i, I already said it but if eagle beats me freaking i might never play this game again because i think i've put in probably 10 hours more than he has oh my gosh i'm facetiming simon right now and i see him 
He is cheering. Okay, I thought he got a hole in one, but he got a two. It must have been a throw in. Tie, tied up. Okay, we got this easy highs. Damn, we're playing some easy holes right now. Maybe, maybe they're saving the tough ones for later. Hole six, part three. 300 feet. Oh gosh, I'm gonna throw a fuse. No, I'm not. I'm gonna throw an explorer. Just nice, straight, and hope for the best. Did I saw it off? Did I ace it? Neither. I parked it. Kind of. Alright, move to lie. Dagger, backhand, a little bit down. That hit, not good, but it stayed in. Man, this course is pretty easy. If I lose to a spit out, that'd be, uh, I'm just, I think I'm just gonna play this rather safe. As I say that and almost, oh my God, what a mistake, bro. Come on, 95 footer, okay, this is a tester. Aim right, the wind will help, give it a chance, drop, 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 yes, 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 don't fall, oh my god, this game, who, second spit out, is this just gonna be my luck, is this just gonna be my luck, please eagle get another par, oh no, oh no, and we're playing at Dusk Could even use a glow disc go pick up a, a glow md3 guys. This is the perfect uh, time to use that whole seven par three 303 feet 303 baby Colorado represent Okay, disc bag Explorer I See it. There's a tree there. I'm just gonna I'm gonna throw it like that Around the tree Get some skip. Oh yeah, baby. Is that a tap in? Tap it in. Nothing is over yet. I can still, yeah, perfect wind. This should not be a problem. The Explorer, it's kind of a disc you'll never get rid of in this game. That is tap in parked. Actually it's not, but I will trust the putting option here. And that was another easy birdie, I think. It's been all par threes. That's very rare. This is like a random hole generator and so far this has been pretty easy. Explorer, should I go for the musket? Let's go with the extra turn, extra glide musket. Aim right here and just shoot it right at it. Don't go right behind the rock. Okay, that's perfect. This is a hole Eagle can potentially mess up and I need this one to stick a lot of people are way better at this game than I am way way better oh no he keeps birding the holes and now I need an eagle or I need eagle to mess up that's pretty funny up one right now ah! focus eagle that's what one of my favorite people from Switzerland always used to tell me. Shout out to Andy Gerch. He trained me and Simon back in uh, 2018 in Switzerland. And whenever I was doing something, he'd always be like, Focus Eagle! And that's the time to do this. It's part three, 324 feet. Gonna go musket hyzer. Let's move over so we don't hit the sign. Right at that dead tree. Some hyzer. Oh! I think that's good, get up. All right, playing disc golf in Stonehenge. I probably should have went a little bit more direct. Dagger, 65 footer, we can make this putt. We can make it no problem. At least that's what I always tell myself. It's always good for, always good to have positive affirmation. Just to the left side, any putt. Off the top. It's a tough hole. Not really. 
If you throw reckless, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It was close. Uh, uh. Oh my gosh. Simon's up by one on the final hole. Why is there no par fours on this layout? We need something epic. This is the final hole. The spider tree, hole number hole number four at Oak Grove. We gotta we gotta run it. We gotta ace run it. Oh my gosh. I'm going for the ace right here. Just gonna rip a musket. Whoa. I don't even know if I can get there. Let's do it. Let's do it. Ah. Nope. Um you don't have a distance. You don't have the distance to get there. You are a noodle arm and you can't do anything. Wow. At least make this pot to make it interesting. Let's just hope for it. Uh, that's not a ch chance. Never a chance. Give me an ace run. Oh gosh, that's not an ace run at all. I've never aced this hole or seen it been aced. Oh, that... I'm just gonna try and throw it into this tree with a musket on a backhand. This wind doesn't help at all. Turn it over, baby. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Oh God, sit. That's gonna be a, such a tester and Eagle has to mess up this hole. I can't, where's the basket? I can't see. Okay, if this doesn't go in, I feel like I've lost. Come on. Yes, okay, I made that. I can only hope that Eagle screwed up one of these holes. He bogeyed? Oh gosh, Eagle. Eagle lost, unless he aces the last hole. Oh boy, that is victory. How do you bogey hole eight? The reigning Disc Golf Valley champion between me and Simon might not be the reigning champ anymore. Definitely not when you cage the putt into the tree. Oh my God. Simon, congratulations. I wish I could have put up a better fight at the end. But you've been playing this game a lot more than I have, so you deserve it. And thanks for watching, guys. Peace. Oh, Eagle finished bogey, bogey. That is just glorious. Seven down to four down. I mean, he was doing pretty well for, uh, I think, his skill set. But at the end, the champion came through, which means Eagle now it is one to one. <laughs> and uh, I'm sure he's uh, thrilled with that. And I am. And now, we're gonna need a tiebreaker match at some point. Coming to you soon. Let's tune in and see what Eagle has to say. All right, Eagle, say something. Say bye to the people. Bye to the people. Are you happy? People. Are you happy with your performance that round? I'm not mad <laughs> because I don't play this game very much. <laughs> you gotta get to practicing for the tiebreaker. I gotta get a driver to make things interesting. Really want that recoil. <laughs> All right, see you later. Peace. All right, guys, that's it for the day. I'm stoked I won, and we have to do a tiebreaker, obviously, at some point. But uh, that's it for now. Thanks for tuning in. Like the video and subscribe if you haven't yet. Team Lazat. Enjoy the shot of the day, and see you next time. Yeah. <laughs>